Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNote.com, and I'm here to give a quick overview on how to play the comparison version of Math Balloons. If you're coming in from YouTube or some other website and aren't familiar with MathNote, we have over 200 free math games to play as well as uh, free fun games. There's never any membership or sign up required. Okay, let's go ahead and get to the game. And when you first start out, this is what the menu is going to look like. Um, you can click to see the written, written instructions here. The click this button to see this video tutorial or click this button to see and play more games on MathNook. Okay, let's go ahead and click the start button. And when you start out, you have the option of playing with positive numbers only or negative numbers and positive numbers. Okay, let's look at the uh, positive numbers. And when you first start out, there's four levels in the game. The uh, you're able this the first level when you first out the first level will be unlocked the other three are uh, levels are locked and um, once you complete this level then you'll the, your score will show up and this level will be unlocked and at that point you can either play this uh, level to complete it or you can go back on the first level and try to get a higher score okay let's go ahead and uh, see the game and this is your match three game where you're going to try to make uh, matches horizontally or vertically of the same colored balloons. Now, to complete this level, you will have to have all the squares uh, showing a yellow background. Currently, you have these squares here with a gray background, these with a black background, and then these two are locked. If you make a match here, then these will turn yellow. The backgrounds in these boxes will turn yellow. If you make a match across these three, this, one will t this background will turn yellow, this will turn gray, and the next match you make over this, then it will turn yellow. This one... Uh, these balloons will not move until you unlock them, and then once you unlock them, then you'll have to uh, turn the background from black to gray to yellow. You have 10 minutes to do it, and when the time runs out, the level, um, if, you, if you have the time run out, then uh, you'll have to, uh, the level end, and you'll have to uh, replay the level to complete it. And the level ends, like I said, when uh, time runs out or you lose all your lives, and these are your lives, and you lose a life by answering a question incorrectly. This button will restart the time. I mean, I'm sorry, will restart the level. This will take you to the uh, menu. This will toggle the music on and off, and this will toggle the sound on and off. This will pause the game, and once it's paused, you can just click this button, and it'll take you back to the game. So, let me go ahead and since I'm running low on time, go ahead and restart the level. And the um, if you look at the balloons, let me, let me go ahead and try to make a match across these four by dropping this balloon down. If I answer this correctly, then this balloon will go away. So what I'm going to go ahead and and say right now, look at I'm going to go ahead and look at the what it's saying here. It says eight plus five. Is, is not equal to 13. Well, that statement is not true, so I'm going to say that's false. And there goes, you saw those turn yellow. I can also get this one to turn yellow by dropping these two blue ones down. 7 plus 9 is equal to 16, that's true. Seven, the, uh, the answer of 7 plus 5, 13, is greater than 8. And there goes those. Okay, now I'm going to kind of look around and see, okay, now these two are pink and there's one there. So I'm going to go ahead, 7 minus 3 is equal to 10. That is false. And you can see those unlock. And actually made it got a bonus match there and it uh, turned it to gray. So now I've got these two yellow green ones here. I'll go ahead and get rid of this one and it'll make a match. This green will drop here and make a match for these four. So 4 plus 7 is 11 and that's not equal to 7. Uh, so that, that statement is true because actually it's saying 11 is not equal to 7, so that's true. I've got a bonus match there. Um, I can go ahead and drop these two pink ones down here and get rid of this, get rid of this gray background. 4 plus 7 is equal to 11, and so the statement is saying 11 is greater than 16. That's not true, so I'm going to click false. 8 plus 5 is 13, and that is not equal to 5, and that's a true statement. Now, Looking around for a match, I can actually get rid of this one, and these three orange will be here, and it'll make a match, get rid of that, 
turn that gray, uh, black to gray. So 9 plus 4 is not equal to 0, and that's true. I can drop this green one down here. Let me go ahead and answer one wrong. So this is saying 6 plus 7, which is, uh, actually equals 13. But they're saying it equals 8. That's false. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and answer, answer true. And I get a new problem, and one of my life went away. So 8 minus 6 is equal to 2. Uh, actually, I don't want to get rid of that one. I want to get rid of this one. 7 minus 6 does equal 1, so that statement's true. And I'm gonna, what I'm going to try to do here, because I've got these two blue ones here. Actually, I was thinking about dropping a blue one in here, but I see this red one here. I can drop it all the way down and make a match over that one and get rid of that one. So 5 plus 8 is 13, but it's saying it's not, so that's false. 6 plus 6 is 12, is less than 15. That's true, and there's my match. Now all I need to do is focus on... Uh, these gray ones here. So I'm trying to see what might be best. I'm going to think what I'm going to do is go ahead and uh, see if I can have an orange one show up here and fall all, down, uh, fall all the way down here once I start getting rid of these balloons and I'll make a match here. So 4 plus 9 is 13 and it's saying 13 equals 13. That's true. 9 plus 4 is 13 is greater than 10. That's true. Um, 8 plus 6 is 14, and that's not equal to 16, so that's true. 7 plus 4, that answer is greater than 0, so that's true. Actually, I, things have changed. I see that I can actually get rid of this one and make a match over these three, and that's better than what I was looking for. And I might still get a, a orange one coming down. 9 minus 3 is equal to 13. That statement is false. And I got that, actually that showed up, got some bonus matches. So now, and I've got plenty of time here, I need to make a match over this square, and over this square, and uh, I'll have completed the level. I'm going to try to mix it up a little bit. I'm just going to get rid, make a match here, and these will match, and it should shake up the board a little bit. 8 minus 1 is greater than 3, and that's true. Um, Let's see, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can get an orange one and drop it down here. So 7, 7, 7 minus 7 is less than 4. That's true. 7 plus 9 is equal. That's true. 8 plus 7 is less than 13. That's false. And there's an orange one, so that's going to really help out. 8 minus 7 um, is less than 3. That's true. Good match. And now I've got to focus on, and there we go. We'll get this green one down. 6 plus 6 is not equal. That's false. And that completes the level. At this point, I can go on the next level, or I can actually submit the score. Let's go ahead and do that. Key in my handle there. And we, we uh, always recommend using a handle versus your real name. And there's my high score. And that's for the day. And it's a new game, but somebody's played this uh, the other day and tested out. And so we have one for the week and month and then all time. I'm number three. So, anyways, click that, get rid of that, and we can either go to the next uh, level here, or we can go back to the main menu. You can see our score, and you can see that the second level's opened up. Okay, well, that's how you play the game. I hope you enjoy playing it, and thanks for watching.